Nếu không ai sót And price level type And we pick, pick fixed percentage And this price level will increase item prices by 10% Round up, you can uh, have a accommodate rounding uh, And you'll be okay So the next step is to assign this to a customer Okay, so I'm going to go to a customer And we're going to pick uh, Chris Baker here. Chris, Chris Baker. Double click on him. Click on the additional info tab. And I'm going to click price off. And he's going to get the benefit of my commercial rate. So I'm going to hit OK. And let's pay attention here. If we go to my item list. Let's see. We got framing labor at $55. So I'm going to go create an invoice for Chris Baker. See, it shows he's got the commercial pricing level up here. And I'm going to pick brand new one. Okay? See how it automatically discounts to $49.50. Okay? And that will do it for every item that I have a price attached to on the item list. So I don't have to think about it. I don't think, who gets what discount kind of thing here? So you, you attach, you create discounts, or any kind of price level, maybe those price increase for no matter and um, attach them to the specific customers. So whenever you can't create an invoice or sales receipt form, QuickBooks knows and adjusts the prices accordingly. Now you might be thinking, well, what if I'm not up for him being, what if I'm not up for being so generous? You can pick the base rate here. And so I'm talking to you So if you get that, for this particular invoice, I'm not going to give you the rate of the 10% uh, discount. So you can override it. Yeah, can you system now or just this invoice? 